Well, it's Sunday afternoon. As you can see, it is beautiful out. Nice breeze. It's probably mid-60s temperature. So I'm down here at our disaster zone. This is the area of our front yard that looks as though a tornado went through. Um, we took down a few trees because they were dying and at risk for dropping on the woodshed there in front of us or the guest house there behind us. So now we're in the process of cutting wood and cleaning up and I've done a lot of cleanup this weekend. Um, Hubs is at a, um, um, a conference this weekend so I'm home alone and I just wanted to show you what I've been up to. So, oops. I forgot my protective earwear. Let me run back to the house and get that. <clears throat> so I thought I would show you firsthand that I do know how to use a wood chipper. Uh, all this nice chipped wood here is going to be dumped into the dry lot for the horses for bedding. Actually, they use it more for potty than for bedding, but um, that's where it goes. So we have a great little wood chipper. It's supposed to be able to chip wood up to a diameter of eight inches. I try not to put anything too big in it because it clogs if you use anything too big. Uh, this is a dangerous implement. You do have to use a lot of caution when you use it. Um, black rolling thing inside there is what sucks the wood down into the blades, so you don't want to get your hands anywhere near that. But it's pretty cool. It runs off the PTO of the tractor. So we hook it up to the tractor take it wherever we want to use it, plop it back down, and I'll show you how it runs. So we'll turn on the tractor. My trusty little deer John, John Deere, 